Hey guys, so today I have a new Build Your Own palette update. This is going to be July's palette. Um, I have a few things in mind maybe that I might pick, um, but we have all of my singles laid out here. We have more over here <laughs> and more over here. Um, but there you go, back in the middle. I did purchase more from Luxy. Um, but I want to put them in a haul video, I think, first before I pull them out. So this was June's palette. I really only wore this a handful of times. Um, like I said in every video, and I've been trying to not say in every video. Oh, Nugget, please do not. Ah! No, 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 no. All right, she's, hold on. I got to put her out in the hallway. All right, so what I was saying, um, with... I wasn't wearing makeup for like a little over a month, so I only wore this a few times. Um, I wore the Pat McGrath shade a few times, maybe like once, I don't know. I did wear this one, I know, at least a handful of times, White Sands from Luxy. I wore that in the inner corner, it was really pretty. I did wear this one, this is Cherry Moss, I think. Yes, Cherry Moss from Coastal Scents, I wore that on the lower lash line. Um, oh my gosh. Ugh, all right, please hold. Okay. Not much damage, a little, a little damage down here, but it's okay. Um, okay, like I was saying, I wore Exotic. I did wear that one once, so it was nice. And then I think I wore this one, Sensation, I think. Yeah, Sensation. I think I wore that once. I did wear this green from Luxy once. Sublime. And then these two I didn't touch at all. This one is from a Depotted Palette. And then this is the Kat Von D Alchemist um, Blue Sapphire. But we're going to put this all away and pick some new stuff for July. Okay, everything is put away. I kind of wiped it out <laughs> a little bit. Um, let's see. I honestly, I don't really know what I want. But I think I'm eyeing this yellow. I think that's just fun for summer. And I'm not painting anything like this. So this is Solar Flare from Coastal Scents. It's just a bright yellow. There you go. Let me take my watch off bright bright yellow really pretty okay I think I'm gonna pick things that are different shapes so we'll see how it works because I do want from over here I don't know if you can see me um but I want this from wet and wild I didn't write what um little trio this was from I want to say it was like a sunset, but I want this like pink shimmery color. There's that. It's pretty. All right, that's what we got there so far. I think I want to bring this one as well. It's another like different shaped pan. This is the little sample from Natasha Denona, and it is silk. I think this was like a something from Sephora maybe oh my gosh it's so pigmented that's really pretty I'm panning a shade pretty much exactly like that but maybe they'll just go good together so let's uh I don't really know where I want to put that but we're just going to put it at the bottom for now we might be able to pick more than with just circle pans also from this palette this is where the Natasha Donona one was I want this purple from Hank and Henry. So I'm gonna try to get that one out. These, the mattes from that Hank and Henry palette, these ones, they, oh my gosh, they're so fragile. But the shimmers, they popped out of that palette really well. So here's the purple. I don't think I have it labeled the name. It's from the Hank and Henry Living in Color palette that we got in BoxyCharm. So there's that purple. It's got like blue glitter in it. 
forgot to grab a makeup wipe, so I'm just like currently covered in glitter. Okay. And then I think that's all from this palette, so I'm gonna just close this one up and put it out of the way. Let's see. I'm eyeing this palette again. I didn't use the one I pulled out last time, but this is just, I feel like they'd be so easy to hit pan on and I'm so close to hitting 100 pans that like, that's what I want to do. Okay, so I think I want something from here. I'm thinking like this one, maybe. I think that's what we're gonna do. Alright, so here is this one. And this is the BH Cosmetics Neutral Eye Palette. It's like a light pink champagne. don't think I want any of these, so I'm going to close this out of the way. We're good with this palette, so we're going to put this one out of the way. I want some from Luxie. Okay, I know I want this one. I was eyeing this earlier. This is Baby Girl. It's a really pretty pink um, coral with like an orange flip. The sun is really beating in right now, so I don't know how well you can see that. I think I want one of these like warm crease colors. They all literally look like basically the same. Um, let's go with this one. Petal Peach. This is what the palette's looking like so far, so we have a little bit of room left. Maybe like one. I don't want any of these purples. This can get put back, I think. Yeah, we have a couple purples. I don't think I want anything from this one either. I'm really leaning towards just picking another Luxy color. I'm obsessed with them. I've used all of the shades on the bottom two rows, but the top two rows I haven't used yet. So that's kind of what I'm looking at. go with this this one looks interesting 24k I think this would be really pretty like kind of on the lower lash line it's like a goldish green yellow it's really cool that's cool it has like a black base to it or like a dark dark brown base to it I have room for like one tiny thing make this look a little better okay um all right so let's close up all the big pans and we'll kind of look at what I have for small pans if I want any of them Okay, it's really just like these two palettes for smallish pans. Um, that's like my palette right there. 
I'm kind of thinking just like one of these. And then maybe I could hit pan on that pretty easy. Can we put both of them? There. All right, so that is going to be the whole palette. Let me swatch these two small ones we just added. They're just light shimmers. So that is going to be my July palette. It's not as pretty organized looking as all the other ones, but I do still want to get use out of my odd shaped pans. So that is what we're going to be working with. I'm excited. I think these three will make a really pretty like summer look. And then with that on the lower lash line, this in the inner corner, I think that'll be really pretty. And I think these ones will be pretty together. So that is going to be everything. Here are our swatches. That color is so cool. All right. So that is going to be everything for my Ju July. I almost said June. <laughs> my July Build Your Own Palette. I hope you guys liked this video. Let me know what you guys would have chose if you would have chose something different. And let me know if you guys do this video as well. This like build your own palette as well because I do really like watching these as well. So let me know if you guys make videos like this. And yeah, definitely like, comment, and subscribe down below for more. <laughs> and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye guys.